Hey guys, welcome back to AX3 Gaming. My name is Alec and welcome back to another episode of WWE 2K23, Rhea's Road to the Universal Championship. So we're not going to talk about the last episode because a couple matches in the last episode did not go our way. However, we are locked into a rivalry with Santos Escobar right now. And if we take a look at our ranking, we're currently ranked number 12. So not terrible, but uh, also not exactly where we want to be. Because if we want to beat Roman, we're going to need to be in the top here and Roman is actually number three right now he's dropped a little bit but like yeah let's get into this first match here I think we're taking on Santos Escobar again on this Friday night yeah we got Legato Del Fantasma versus the Judgment Day which is actually very similar to what's been going on lately but let's get into this match guys so we got our actions here the referee KO number two is what's apparently gonna happen but we'll see we'll see what actually happens because usually that's not ex exactly what happens anyway Rhea male taking on santos escobar here let's see how it goes okay so something is gonna happen oh and right off the bat the referee goes down and santos and Rhea brawling to the outside right off the bat and Rhea pushing the ref halfway across the ring here. And Rhea is not going to waste any time. She's going to grab a chair, get whatever advantage she can until the ref gets back. But Santos is not going to let her cheat here. Okay, here we go. Now Rhea's got the chair. Ref's still down. Okay, she went for it and she missed. Oh, there we go. Oh, God. She snuck one in there. She snuck a couple shots in there. And Santos already hurting pretty bad here. This might be the only way that Rhea can defeat Santos after, after taking a loss to him last week. Rhea definitely needs to get back on the winning streak if she's going to win the Universal Championship here. So she's willing to do anything to get that victory. Santos has no... Has had no offense so far. Rhea has had an answer for everything Santos has thrown at her. He's probably a little loopy from those chair shots. <laughs> Right at the beginning, and Rhea already here. Maybe looking to finish this match. And it's going for the rip tide, and she hits it. Can Santos kick out of this? Ooh, and he does. Santos still in this. Not going to go down without a fight here. But it might just be a matter of time for Rhea. With the advantage that she was able to pull out at the beginning here. Back and forth here. Rhea's got the bigger Santos on her shoulders. She hits the face buster. Oh, but Santos goaded her in. Can he get the victory here? No, Rhea was ready for it as well. And she was able to kick out of it. But Santos able to gain control now. Come on, Rhea. She gets right back in. And nails him with the riptide again. With her crazy hair. And that... Really? I genuinely thought that was it. Rhea going for something big. Here we go. <laughs> and she completely misses it. Santos just slid right out of the way there. But Rhea not going to give up control. And Rhea's been taking it to Santos this whole time. Santos has, hasn't even had a chance to get out of the blocks here. Now Rhea's going to the top rope. And she's going to hit the... Ooh, not going to hit anything. She's going to hit the canvas is what she's going to hit. And now Santos getting a bit of offense. Rhea's got to be getting frustrated now. Hit Santos with a couple big shots and nothing's put him away yet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The Phantom Driver. Santos hit it. Bro, what is wrong with me? How am I not kicking out of these? Honestly, something's wrong here. Do I just get nervous? Because those are so easy to kick out of and I'm just missing them. And I also hit them with like... Okay, so Rhea's losing streak continues here. Oh my god. Okay, I'm actually genuinely concerned and annoyed by that. Okay, we need to actually get a match. We're going to face Santos Escobar again. We're still number 12, so that's okay. We need to get a victory this video. Okay, we need to. And we're going to face Santos again. And I even hit him with a chair to start out the match. Oh my god. Okay, post-match torso injury. All right. 
No, Santos got whatever he wanted to do. So let's see what Santos is gonna do here. Damn it, how did one... Like, he barely hit me the whole match. I hit him with a bunch of finishers and signatures. And he hit me with one freaking Riptide, or one freaking Phantom Driver, and that's it. And now he's attacking me before the match, right in the knee. Yeah, and look, my knee's already destroyed, and now he's going back to it. If I can't win when I have the advantage, there's no way I'm going to win now, right? No, I can't screw around. I, I need to just, like, make him tap <laughs> as quick as possible. Took me out right at the knee. And now we're having our third match against Santos Escobar. He's up two to nothing on us. So we need to get at least one victory to not make this a one-sided rivalry. And to get to the Universal Championship, we're not going to get anywhere if we keep losing to Santos Escobar here. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Let's hit him with some big moves here. Okay, well, this is not one of them. Come on. There we go. We've got to reverse a couple. Let's make sure he doesn't get a finisher. For some reason, I can't freaking kick out of his finisher even when he hits one on me. Okay, let's see if this freaking tope is going to work out. No. Nope. He got in too quickly. Suplex there. Hitting some big power moves. We're getting similar on health now, so that's good. Let's cut up to the top rope here. Rhea's gonna fly! On a Santos! And she hit it perfectly. Okay, here we go. I'm not gonna screw around. I'm just gonna freaking submit him. Where the heck is the finisher? Oh, it's by his head, but it's just not showing up. Here we go. And he freaking reversed it. <laughs> But I still have his signature. And now he's going to try to submit me with the walls of freaking Jericho. Come on, dude. No way that's happening. The face buster. Bam. Let me try and pit him off that. I don't even care. I don't even care about putting on a good match. I just need a victory. Damn it. Still kicked out. Oh my god. And he has a finisher and signature now, and he's going to hit me with something, and I'm going to lose immediately. Watch what's going to happen. Okay, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. Choke him with the boot. Oh my god. He's reversing everything, dude. Come on. And he's going to hit me now? Nope. He ain't. Oh my god, okay. I thought he went for his finisher again when I missed that elbow. Let's hit him with something big here. Come on, dude. The reversals are going back and forth here. Okay, here's what we're gonna freaking do. We're gonna hit him with his own freaking move. It's the only way. Because apparently the Phantom Driver is impossible to kick out of. Unless you're Santos Escobar, of course. But now, hit him with the prism trap. There we go. He's got to tap out, right? Come on. It's on. Yeah, that's it. There we go. Ending the losing streak. Finally, but... Rhea's leg is hurt, though. From that attack at the beginning of the match. It seems like in this rivalry, whoever gets the upper hand before the match ends up actually losing the match, so. Last time Rhea had a, had a rib injury, and it just went away. So I'm hoping the same thing happens with this leg injury, but I guess, I guess we'll see what happens. Let's check out Rhea's rankings now that we finally got a friggin' victory for once. Oh, next match we got Hell in a Cell, probably going up against Santos. And a Hell in a Cell match, but we're still number 12. Fair enough, since we lost a couple. Where is Santos Escobar? He's number seven. So if we're able to beat him at the pay-per-view, we should be able to get um, a pretty decent boost on that. Why is Big E so much ahead of us now? I guess he beat us at the pay-per-view, right? We're coming for that title, Roman. You're not safe. Rhea Ripley is going to be taking that title from you soon. Thank you so much for stopping by, guys. Hope you did enjoy. There's a subscribe button right underneath me. Here's more videos on the right. I'll catch you guys in the next one.